Finding mass from linear density. What is the mass of a wire whose linear density, lambda of x, is given by x squared from 0 to 3, 9 from 3 to 5, and 0 for all other values? Okay, so the general equation for density, normally rho, and its mass per unit volume. But for a linear density, the way I remember this is mass equals love. So you draw a heart, put a line through it, you have an M on top and a V on bottom. And that's the mnemonic. Um, for linear density, it's linear density equals mass per unit length, or X. And so what we're going to do is we're going to integrate lambda of X dx for 0 to 3 plus lambda of x from 3 to 5 and that should give us our linear density for um, the wire and then 0 for everything else so the integral of 0 is a constant but then we'll put limits of integration and we'll get 0 so it's fine so put in our values here change colors 0 to 3 x squared dx plus 3 to 5 9 dx equals x cubed over 3 yes 0 to 3 plus 9x from 3 to 5 which gives us 27 over 3 minus 0 plus 9 times 5 minus 9 times 3 okay 27 over 3 is 9 plus 45 nope I'm gonna do it this way 9 times 5 minus 3 which is 2 so we have 9 plus 18, which is back to 27. Ah, very convenient. So 27. Ah, that's even an answer, which is even more convenient and good and nice. So 27. So the key concept here is want to find mass given a linear density. Um, so density is normally mass divided by volume. So if you want to find a volume given a density, you'll integrate over... Um, the volume, so x, y, and z coordinates probably. Well, normally when you work in physics, you're probably given a constant density, and so the equation becomes very simple. You don't even, don't even realize that what you're doing is integrating. It's just viewed as algebra. Well, with the linear density, you're given a density based on the x value, or the y value, or the z value, a single dimension, so to speak. And... So what we did then is we integrated from 0 to 3, 3 to 5, given our specific values. And then we found an answer and solved the problem. And that is the idea behind linear density.